Hello and welcome to the show. Melania Trump has made history, breaking a nearly 200 year string of commonality between all first ladies. She is the first lady to be an immigrant since sixth US President John Quincy Adams' wife Louisa in 1825. Born Melania Navs in Novo Mesto, Slovenia, then part of Yugoslavia, she then grew up in Sevnica, Slovenia. In the mid-90s, she dropped out of university to follow a modeling career jetting back and forth from Paris to Milan. Then in 1996, she moved to the US and two years later met Donald Trump at a party in New York. The pair were married in 2005 and a year later, Melania not only got American citizenship, but also gave birth to their son, Baron. In 2016, Donald ran to be president and won, elevating Melania to the position of first lady. Louisa Catherine Adams, who held the post from 1825 to 1829, was the first first lady to be born outside the United States and the only one until Melania 192 years later. Louisa was born in London the illegitimate daughter of an American merchant and an unknown English woman. She grew up in London and Nantes, France, where the family took refuge during the American Revolution. Louisa's father was appointed the US Consul General in 1790 and John Quincy Adams, the son of second US President John Adams, visited his house in London on a number of occasions where he met Louisa. The pair married in London and the family eventually all moved to the US. John and Louisa had four children, although they sadly outlived three of them. In 1824, John ran to be president and won, making Louisa first lady, but failed to be re-elected four years later and spent the rest of his career in the House of Representatives. Despite making history as the first first lady to be born outside the US in 192 years, Melania has always supported her husband's hardline views on immigration. In 2015, she told People magazine, I went through a whole long process to become a citizen. It didn't even cross my mind to just stay here. I think people should follow the law. Melania was reportedly paid for 10 modeling jobs in the US before she obtained her H-1B green card and was still living in the US using her visitor visa. A report from 2017 read, Foreigners are not allowed to use a visitor visa to work for pay in the US for American companies. Doing so would violate the terms of that visa and could prohibit a foreigner from later changing his or her immigration status to the US or or bar foreigners from the US again without special permission to come back. In 2001, Melania obtained an EB1, dubbed the Einstein Visa, reserved for people highly acclaimed in their field, for example Olympic athletes or Oscar-winning actors. She was one of just a few people given this grant, this type of visa that year. President Trump has also crusaded against chain migration before, a process by which US citizens can obtain residency for their relatives. He has branded the family-based immigration program outdated and vowed to bring an end to it. In 2017, he tweeted, Chain migration must end now. Some people come in and they bring their whole family with them who can be truly evil, not acceptable. While her husband has demonized so-called chain migration, Melania in fact brought her parents Victor and Amalija Navs to the US using this process. She sponsored their green cards so they could have residency in the US and they were sworn in as US citizens last year. Thank you.